Hey everyone, Benjamin here. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how you can start selling your Canva template. So don't go anywhere and I will be right back. So one of the ways you can start selling your Canva template is by doing these four easy things I'm about to show you. And if you're new to the whole making money with Canva, this is a sure way you can start making money using Canva. So let's dive straight into the first step. Okay, so the first step is by creating your template. And let me just say that this is not limited by just templates. You can actually use the same idea for other digital products. So before you start designing your template, you should first know the type of template you want to create. And even to help you with this um, particular step, you can ask a few people you know who are following you or you know if you just know a few friends and family you can ask you can just ask them you know what type of template they would prefer and they should help you to know what they are looking for so that when you are creating you can be sure it's actually going to be used by the people you are creating it for so let's dive into canva let me show you one template i created ladies and gentlemen uh, let's get ready to rumble Okay, so this is a Christmas template I created inside of Canva and you can see this is a very easy to edit you know, template. It's just a matter of selecting the text and just putting in your information or that. Okay, and I want to be able to sell this particular template. So what are the things I need to do? The first thing is I'll need to download the template as a PNG format or as any of the photo formats. Okay, so I'll just come back into Canva, come to share image and I'll click on download image. Okay, with the format, I'm going to leave it to PNG and I'll just click on download. So this is the first thing you need to do and the second thing we are going to do is to create a pdf downloadable file and that's where we are going to attach the photo format of our template so now that number is giving me the option to download my template i'll just click on save so that it gets to be saved in my download folder and you can see that you know it has been downloaded successfully so now let me just walk you through how you can create a simple pdf downloadable file so all you need to do is to click on create a design and you can just search for a4 over here then choose a4 document okay so this is actually going to be something very easy to create but just to save you the whole time of doing all of this from scratch i actually created a template and the link can be found in the description box below so there's a template i created and this is very easy to edit so if i zoom in a little bit you can just you know edit these words over here you can just choose and say anything of your choice okay and um, everything here can be edited you understand so with this particular photo over here we are actually going to insert the photo format of our design okay or of our template i'll just come to upload files and i'll click on you know i'll just choose the appropriate design i want to sell so you can see it's currently being uploaded so once it's done you can just easily drag and drop it into this okay because it's very easy to customize so you can see how easy and simple it is and the next thing you just have to do is to edit this particular button we have over here so this is what you need to do to make it easier for your customer to be able to use your template we are going to embed the template link into the button i just showed you so let me just show you how you can go about it so all i need to do is to come to my christmas you know template over here come to share and make sure you're looking for a template link click on it if you're not seeing it just come to more and scroll down you should see it over there so i'll just come to template link and i'll click on copy so i have just copied it and i just move back to my pdf the button over here and just make sure you're looking for link okay paste it over here and press enter okay once it's done you can also select the text alone come over here choose the link and do the same enter so you can see we have now been able to embed the template link into this button okay after you are done with that all we need to do is to click on share make sure you come to download choose pdf standard okay then click on download so we are now downloading our design as a pdf format because this would make it easy for people to be able to click on the link and start using our template okay so i'll just download my file okay and it should save successfully so you can see it has downloaded so i am inside my downloads folder okay and this is the file right here i have it open as you can see see and if i scroll down so you can see once i hover over <laughs> <laughs> when i want to explain it my head will be t headache me yeah <laughs> Uh, this is very interesting once i hover over this button you can see that um the cursor gets to change into the finger so i can click and you can see that it gets to open inside my browser you understand so now if i'm to click on this button i can start using my canva template so we have been able to sort this out okay so the next thing we have to do is to create a mock-up of our template okay so this is just going to help us make our template sellable so what we are going to do is to head on to mediamodifier.com okay so let me just open a new 
tab and head on to media modifier okay so once i just go in there you can see how you know the whole platform is just very easy to use and um, i choose media modifier over canva when it comes to mockups because they have a wide range of mockups and it's very easy to customize you understand i'll just come to mockups okay and i'll just click on mockup generator so you should see there are so many interesting you know mockups we can actually use and if you want to use media modifier i have a link in the description box below that can help you get started with media modifier thank you for the word so sweet okay so let me just come over here and search for flyer okay so if i search for flyer or poster i should just get a whole lot of you know uh, mockups i can customize in here so you can see how it's looking at the moment so i can choose this one in particular and um yeah, everything is loaded beautifully so once i click in here i am giving the option to choose any of my previous uploads and um, you can see i have the design already in here so i can just select it but just in case i didn't have it in there i could just easily come to upload you know your image and you see this window will be open for me to select any of my designs okay so once i have it in here i'll just click on stretch so that i guess to fit nicely in here you can see how everything is looking and to download it you know we can do a lot of customization over here with the background color we can just change it to any color of our choice but i think wow this is looking beautiful already so i think i'll stick to the red so all we need to do next is to click on download and just have to choose download image okay you can see my image i've actually downloaded the image twice <laughs> okay so now that we have this okay i can just uh, i'll just create another one okay so let me just come back here and um, just go back here and just choose poster because i'll need two different mockups okay so i'll just search and we can see what we have over here so this is basically us just trying to find um, a very good mockup to use so we can even use this one even though it's the same type you know but of a different angle okay so i just choose again come to my uploads and just choose select just in case you're hidden in the background i leave in the nancy house so just um, you know pardon me then just click on stretch okay and this is looking so beautiful okay then what i need to do next is to you know the background color i'll just switch it to red again click on download and download okay so because this we are just trying to make sure our template is sellable so that anyone who comes in there can just you know be impressed you know and be convinced that they actually need to get this um, template so that's what we are just trying to do so all we need to do is to click on download and choose download image and it should also be downloaded over here so the next thing we are going to do is to choose a platform we want to sell our templates on i get to use that store because of the many monetization features it comes with and i would highly recommend stand store because look let me just take you through some of the things you can actually do with stand store okay so if i come in here and i just you know come to this button and choose add product you can see you can collect emails you can literally make people book paid calls or paid coaching on your calendar you can have custom product you carry membership e-course webinars you can do just so many things and you can also sell you know a digital product so that's what we are actually going to do so i'll just choose sell a digital product okay so i'll come to choose image and just click on upload image and i can choose any of the mockups of my choice okay then i'll just click on crop so once it's done it should reflect over here quickly okay then what we are just going to do is to add our heading so what i'm going to say here is customizable christmas template and in the subheading we can just put anything here of our choice so this is what i'm going to say promote your christmas offers to make the best out of the holiday season i know this sounds whack but don't worry <laughs> okay then we come to the checkout page and this is going to be like a mini landing page okay so you can see how it looks at the moment i'll click on choose image and i'll just uh, choose the other uh, mockup we created okay so once i upload the image this is how it should look over here so you can see it's uploading and um, it will just change and then it will get here quickly okay so i can just get my christmas templates now okay and this option you know you can just add all the things in here your copy and make sure you are just adding something that would attract people to buy from you okay then you can add your price you can add a discount price if you want to you know offer some discount you can just turn this on and you know and add the discount price over here then what you can do is you can also add a discount code you understand limited quantity just in case you just want to give a number of times people can download your template or can buy your template you can just add it over here okay then with the fields you know the information you require from your customers you can just add more over here you understand but i don't want the telephone number so i'll just turn it off and i'll just also turn it off because you know it shouldn't be visible if i don't need it okay so what we are going to do next is to upload our pdf file over here so i click on upload 
and I'll choose my PDF file. So it should upload in here. And you can see how easy it is to use Stamp Store to already sell your templates. You understand? So now that it's done, what we need to do is to just come to our advanced tab over here and we can see other bumps. So just in case you have other products, okay, you can just choose them from here. So for example, if I choose my 60 design template, this is how it's going to look like. You can see how it looks right here. Okay, but I'll just turn it off for now. And um, if you want to create an affiliate, you know, link and stuff like that, you can also do that over here so that other people can promote your products. Okay, then you can have some reviews in here. Then you can also add your call to action. So this is a template. It's not a guide. I can just edit and say, get my template. Okay. Oh, what am I even saying? Template. No, so it's template. Okay. This is how to spell template. Now, you know, with the button over here, you can just say, purchase or anything at all you want to add or any word at all you want to have then with the confirmation email okay you can customize it according to your choice okay and you can also integrate this with mailchimp okay so you can turn it on and do all the linking in there you understand so once you're done with every single thing all you need to do is to click on publish okay and once you click on publish you should now see it in here so you can see customizable christmas templates so i don't want it to be at the bottom so i can just move it to the top um what is it okay christmas template and i can just move it to the top so it's showing in here so you can see how easy it is to add any product into stand store to start selling and once you finish doing that in fact let me just yeah. okay so once you start doing this you can now promote it on instagram just to let your audience know that you have a new template available for them to start using and this is one of the ways i was actually making money with canva so i make templates and to sell them i use media modifier and stand store working all together to help me make my templates sellable so that it can really be attractive to anyone who is looking to buy some templates so yes i hope you found this video helpful and just in case you're looking for a particular tutorial i haven't made yet can you leave a comment in the comment section below like this video to support the video and the subscribe button is definitely yours to smash if you are new to the channel the name is benjamin always remember there is no limit to creativity and i should see you in my next tutorial